All right. It is Sergei Pavlovich time. All right, let's see what we can do. Oh, come on now, John. It's already getting bad. Fight hasn't even started yet. It's already... Oh, come on, dude. But yeah, Sergei Pavlovich is actually facing my boy Tom Aspinall. And tell me how that fight's going to go. Um, I honestly think if if sir if if Tom Aspinall actually you know what since this is a Sergey Pavlovich video I'm going to I'm going to talk for Sergey Pavlovich. Sergey Pavlovich literally needs to force Bro, relax. Oh, don't run away now. I hate when people I hate when people play like that. They play so aggressive once they get that that good little amount of damage. They just want to look. They just want to run. They want to run. Yep. Oh, okay. So I guess EA doesn't want to slip. Don't don't want the slip to happen. Okay, let's back up. There we go. Cause John Jones. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We toxic today. We toxic today. Come on, bro. Relax. Let's keep it civil. Come on, bro. I mean, you, you literally want to lose. You literally want to lose. You literally want to lose. Bro, I'm already knowing. I'm already knowing. Good night. Honestly, I really should jump so I could cut his face more. Because look at our... Literally, look at our eye. If the ref wanted to, he could come in and look at us like right now. But we're Sergei Pavlovich. We have the power to put him to sleep at any time. And he quit the game. All right. This is getting to the next one. Why does um Sergey start off in Southpaw? It's kind of odd. Give me that leg. Okay, Derek. Okay, Derek. We're playing Derek Lewis. And um, if this patch is what it says it is, it decre it decreased the um the well it increased stamina like from strikes or something like that. Then Derek should be gassed. So actually, let's let's do something. Let's do let's 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 test this. Is he okay? Come on, yeah. Stay in the fight. Let's mo let's mostly let's play let's try to play as sim as possible. Let's play let's try to play as sim as possible and let's work his body. Okay. Boom, nice. Let's work his body and let's see if he is gassed at least by the third round. And let's try to keep him alive to see the third round at least. Cause y'all know Sergey Pavlovich, man. Oof, this power, and it looks like he's already making a lot of mistakes. So, and he's already firing off those uppercuts because we're going to his body a lot. So, and what I see is what I see is playing a playing sim is basically you just just playing the game to a point where you're playing to your fighter the you know fighter weaknesses. And fighter strengths like mine's is boxing, mostly boxing. You know, you never really see Sergey Pavlovich do anything else, right? So what I'm going to do is is literally mostly box. You know, use my really good cross, my really good jab, my really good body hook. Okay, so he cut us. I mean, it's Derek Lewis. That power is gonna hurt. Yeah, you're gonna look excited. There we go. I, I threw a combination because he's coming in throwing those like singular strikes. Like he's coming in boom, boom, boom. You see that? So if we can throw a full combination and interrupt him into that, like something like that, interrupt him in between that sequence he's so used to. Okay, yeah, he's throwing that uppercut like a lot. So okay, let's watch our head health because this is Derek Lewis. There we go. Boom, boom. Let's keep attacking that cut. And yeah, we're like I said, we're really gonna try to work the body. No. Okay. There we go. Nice little combination. Okay, we really should be doing head movement, honestly, instead of just taking these hits for free. There we go. Okay, so it's Stam in the first round. 
I I would say it's a little high for to for, you know for Derek Lewis. I mean, given he really didn't throw much, um, and we're working his body since I, I don't know, man. He landed more significant, so I would say he got that round. I'm somehow. <laughs> I feel like we I feel like we landed we landed more, and I feel like I don't know. I mean, that's how this game is, bro. Okay, so he got a pretty big hunk of stamina. Oh, this is going to hurt. Okay. It's a nice little sequence. We went to the body and the head. Pretty good amount of times. And the fact that his, like, his stamina is like not even like tickled is crazy to me. But, you know. Okay, there we go. So now we're actually targeting his stamina. Oh no. Before even before before we even before we even Okay, you know what? I'm I'm kinda go easy on him. But he's not making it easier for himself, like He's making these mistakes, man. I feel like I'm not even doing that much. Okay, we're still rocked, which is nice. There we go. Hit him with that cross one two. One, two, three. Okay, now he's kind of picking up the pace. So I mean, we're we're gonna. I don't want to lose the match, y'all. So hey, we might be forced to. You feel what I'm saying? Pick up the pace ourselves. Oh, don't tell me you're quitting. Oh no, don't tell me you're giving up. Don't tell me you're giving up. Please do not tell me you're giving up. Please do not tell me you're giving up. All right. Well. All right. He's giving up, so yeah, let's just knock him out. Let's just knock him out. All right, well, let's get into the next one. All right, so he's using Tom Aspinall, so uh, like I said, literally he just needs to make Tom Aspinall box. I don't feel like I haven't talked about the fight more. Yeah, he just needs to force Tom Aspinall to box with him, and he just needs to keep his boxing real clean. And um, necessarily try to be first. Definitely try to be first in some of the exchanges. Simply because Tom Aspinall is just a quicker fighter. He is just a quicker... Why does he want to wrestle so bad? Is he okay? Like, it's always these people that play so odd. And like, you just cannot believe that they play like an M a MMA game like this, you know? Like they straight get on here and, st and like throw like throw stuff like that. Like, do you ever see an MMA fighter do that? I guess this is the casual audience that EA is trying to appeal to. Guess is this, guess this is what they're making the game off of. Boom, boom, double leg kick. Never seen that before. No, we still here. Three piece. Okay, so he shot a takedown. But yeah, he just needs to force uh, Tom Aspen all the box. And I think Sergey definitely can get a KO between rounds one and two. I don't know really. I don't know much about his cardio. Um, I don't know much about his chin. Uh, I know he has gotten KO'd before in the UFC. But um, people who've been watching Sergey Pavlovich in the comments definitely can tell me if his chin is you know like certified you see what i'm saying like because some people's chin uh are a little suspect why does it always push me back to southpaw he's not a southpaw i kick but um yeah Um, one thing I will say that actually in the Tom Aspinall showcase that I will make, I am going to, he doesn't, he didn't even know what to do on the ground. And look, he's literally like, he doesn't even know what to do on the ground. He's literally just shooting takedowns for no reason. Like, look at him. Yeah, let's just, uh, I tried to jump on him. All right. Whoa. How's he not how's he not gone? Uh oh, it's getting bad for him. Cause you didn't even let your stand recover. Oh, okay. 
Is he actually trying to go for a free? Like this, this is adorable. Like, the fact that somebody can play this game, not really know what they're doing, but always know the rear naked choke cheese from UFC 4, like, that's actually pitiful. That's actually pitiful. Like, that's straight muscle memory, bro. Like, that's straight muscle memory. Anyways. Um, let's see if we can possibly KO this dude this round. Um, submit him, whatever he wants. Whatever he gets himself into. Now, I ain't gonna lie, if he takes us down instantly and, like, somehow gets us in, like, in a submissions and cranks instantly, and, like, you feel what I'm saying, and we, we can't get it and we lose, that's gonna be a, the most craziest comeback. And we're definitely gonna be put on somebody's channel. I came back against a UFC pro sweat. Looking at Okay, he's making us watch this. It's kind of awkward. No, I'm just fine. All right, let's get to it. Okay, he didn't want to touch gloves. Okay. Okay, when he gets into, when he gets started, when he starts getting hit by like a barrage of like, or a combination or a barrage of punches, he gets super, super defensive and then he starts shooting. Yeah, it's like he does not like to be in the fire. For too long, at least. It's like he's only in the fire if he wants to. I really didn't mean to do this. We de we're definitely going to get a knockout. I don't know. Okay. Good night. That really should have put him to put him to bed. What what's our power like ninety eight? And we, we didn't we didn't put him to bed because of, come on man. I'm I know I'm jumping. I'm not letting you quit the game. I'm not letting you quit the game. All right. Um, I think we can play one more. We can definitely play one more. One more but ha, with Sergey Pavlovich. Bro. All right, coming into our last match, we're playing Muhammad Ali. So. It's not gonna be a necessarily an easy boxing. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, one thing I do want to ask you guys: Did he just throw? A, oh no! Oh yeah, you want? Oh, okay, okay, Ali. You just do a leg kick. Yeah, I'm shooting a takedown. I'm shooting it. I'm not gonna fool around with you. I'm not gonna fool around with you. Come here. I'm not gonna fool around with you, Ali. I'm not finna fool around with you. No, it's not finna be that easy. Let me let me take your back now. Now it's getting now it's getting scary. Uh oh, now it's getting scary. Uh oh, oh he three to nine. Okay, <laughs> okay. He said he said no no sir. Oh okay, so he got out. Okay, let's see if he knows how to grapple. Uh, I'm not sure what Ali's uh, bottom game is, but I'm pretty sure it's not the best. Okay, so we hurried up and denied that before he could trans. Yeah, he's one of those. He's one of those that only transitions when that, like when we transition. Bro, I'm I'm not using, I'm not throwing any straight strikes, bro. Why are you? Why? Oh no, oh no, armbar. Okay, so yeah, he does not. No, come here. No, bro, dude, what is wrong with this dude? Why does he keep going the same way, expecting a different result? Like, <laughs> why does my face look so shiny? I'm literally noticing that just now. I know, I know, I know. I'll be calling myself shiny KOD, but goodness gracious, it's crazy right now. Uh, let's just throw like itsy bitsy poo poo strikes. No, we have the grapple advantage. Okay, let's see if we can pre deny right. Let's see if we can pre deny this. Okay, it looks like he's waiting for us, so let's just throw. Oh, he was. What a weirdo. What a weirdo. What a weirdo. 
Okay, so he's waiting for us to just do to just to, to just move. Now you have to go right back into top mount. By you not moving and you not taking a risk, Ali, you got you got put back in the position that you got arm arm bar. Come here. Okay, let's see if he's gonna transition. He does. No, thank you. Oh, he's he's panicking. He is panicking. And the fact that he can he can do that. It's crazy. But yeah, we literally controlled him for literally the whole round. Look at that. That was an amazing 10-8. Oh, look at the coach talking about don't force a submission. I ain't gonna lie, I'm kind of forcing it. Uh, maybe I should definitely be a little bit more patient because look at him. Look at his head moving on the ground. <laughs> like, brother, just hold your block. Hold your block. I mean, but sometimes I can't, I can't like break his block on the ground. That's why the block in this game is just so odd, honestly. Okay, so he doesn't want to touch gloves. Bro, Ali, I gotta tell you something. You turned into you turned it into a, and look now you now you back on the ground. You turned it into an MMA match when you when you when you kicked my leg, and now he quit the game. What up? Yeah, just just I'm gonna end this video here. Um, yeah, this guy is honestly like a, honestly pitiful. You can't you can't you can't throw leg kicks. I was actually gonna box with him. Like believe it or not, like I was gonna try to you know try my best to box with him. Um, cause in my mind I was like, you know, I know I can easily, you know, take him down, cause I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm an MMA, I'm an actual, actual MMA fighter, you know. But um, he threw a leg kick, and I'm like, oh, okay, so you want to make this an MMA fight then? I'm petty. I'm sorry. All right, love y'all, man. See you on the next one.